Hi, I'm Manjit Kauru and I'm a narcissistic abuse recovery therapist. Today, I'm going to talk about narcissistic in-laws. Do you have narcissistic in-laws? If you do, this video is for you. Dealing with narcissistic in-laws is hard work. Narcissistic in-laws will ensure you are not included or welcome. They will do anything to single you out and to covertly make you feel unwelcome. They make extra efforts to isolate your partner in order to influence and control them so you feel alone. They will even manufacture drama and false allegations to pit you and your partner against one another. They are simply pitting your spouse against you and they may see it or may not. As you and your partner argue, they will watch in the background and smirk at the rift they have created between you. They have achieved the outcome they wanted. Your in-laws strive on the drama and your partner is likely unaware that this is happening and may blame you or not for making an effort. It just depends on how much of a toxic dance they are in with your in-laws. Your in-laws will even use gaslighting tactics so that you feel you are going crazy. They say things and then deny it. As you react, you look like the crazy one if you call them out. They will watch you with a smirk. They turn every family member against you by creating false stories which further isolates you from everyone else. No one will believe you because they are that convincing. If you have children, your in-laws will try to turn those children against you by overbuying gifts, saying toxic things about you so that your child does not know who to believe. Alternatively, they will not pay any attention to you or your child, which means your child misses out on grandparent time. This is all to hurt you. It has nothing to do with your child or partner. It is all to hurt you. If you are dealing with narcissistic in-laws, I hope your partner is on your side because it will feel like a battlefield. If your partner is not on your side and continues to blame you, you will have to review your marriage and whether it can survive. Your partner could be trauma bonded to their parent or alternatively, you could be dealing with a toxic narcissistic spouse. If you feel you can survive this marriage, limit contact with your in-laws, cut the emotional supply and grey rock. If you, you would like to know more about what I do, visit my website. The details are below. You might also want to get a copy of my book, Survival Guide for Toxic Narcissistic Relationships on Amazon. Don't forget to like and share my video. If you have any questions, stick them in the comments. Thank you for watching.